Um, as you know, the 2020 Olympics have been postponed to 2021. I was especially looking forward to it um, because it was going to be the first time both skateboarding and surfing um, were going to be in the Olympics. So I'm a little bummed by that, but obviously I understand. Um, so I'm going to leave you with this. Um, thanks to technology and all things we talked about with the evolution of surfing from uh, the initial, like, you know, Hawaiians cutting down specific trees and carving their own boards to polyurethane to epoxy to fins to obviously... Um, um, things like uh, um, leashes and, and wetsuits, uh, surfing has come a very long way. Um, but the, and the one thing that I think is now the, one of the coolest things about um, the world of surfing that we get to witness and feel um, is the, the, the just GoPro cameras being able to be put on surfboards and us be able to feel like we're actually in the water with the riders. Um, so... I just feel, I don't know why, I, I've always felt the ocean in general is very relaxing and very calming. And um, even though I surf very little and when I was a kid, um, I've always loved the idea of it. And I always felt, I don't know, happy when I surfed and happy when I watched surfing. So just because of that, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave you with this GoPro montage video that I found. Watch as much of it as you want. Um, it... Honestly, it, I just have it as just like a, a kind of a, a zen video. I watch it and I just I just relax while doing it. So hopefully um, you get some enjoyment out of it. Anyway, thanks for listening to this lecture. Um, questions and whatever you can you can email me or um, send emails to uh, or um, um, comments to Jordan um, Janelle and um, uh, we'll talk about skateboarding next. Okay.